Hello everyone! Yes, today is our third class and then yeah, and then before we did study what? The listening part of topic. And so this time today we're gonna study like we'll learn, yeah, like speaking, like conversational, like daily Korean. Yeah, and then yeah, like what she prepared kind of question list. Let's see what she really wanna know how to speak. This sentence in Korean. All right, so 봅시다. Basic but then very important. So that's why I wanted to film this one. So first one, this one. Actually, this is this phrase. No, this sentence is what Nini really need these days in her daily life. So, but then who knows, like there are some of my subscribers who lives in Korea as a student. So maybe they also might need, uh, how to say this in Korean naturally, maybe in convenience store. So, okay. So look at this. Please charge the remaining money on this T-Money card. So it means like when you were buying something in the convenience store and you, maybe you, you might have like changes, but then you want to charge that money on the T-Money card, which is the public transportation card in Seoul. Yeah, so how we can say that in English? First, the remaining money. So at first, we have to know this one, the remaining money. This is kind of keyword, right? So the remaining money is, we call it 잔돈. 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 So this, this will be subjective. So we have to add 은, which makes the front noun as subjective. So, 잔돈은, 잔돈은, 티머니에, 티머니에, 에, 충전. What is 충전? Nini already knew this one. 충전 is charge. For example, um, what, about, what about like mobile charger, like a phone charger? Mm -hmm. Phone charger. What is phone? 말해봐. 핸드폰. 맞아. <laughs> 핸드폰, 핸드폰 charger, 충, 전, 기. What is this key mean? Machine. 맞아. Smart. Machine. <laughs> so 충전기. So 핸드폰 충전기 is phone charger. So 충전 해주세요. Also means charge. So please 해주세요. So please. So 잔돈은 티머니에 충전해 주세요. Please charge the remaining money. On my T money card. Okay, okay. And then this one. Well, you know, um, I'm trying to speak only Korean to Nini during our class. But then just before I ask her, 예를 들면 뭔데? 예를 들면 뭔데? But then maybe 예를 들면 was quite fast. Maybe I pronounce it very fast. So even though she knew this 예를 들면, but she didn't understand at first. So I want you to. No, this one, 예를 들면, is for example, like for instance, you know, instance. But we usually say, 예를 들면, 예, actually 예 is an example. 예를 들면, 예를 들면, but how to say, 예를 들면, <laughs> 이렇게 빨리. Yeah, it's very fast, 들면. 알면. We use yeah. it, like, yeah, but 예를 들면, but actually it's 예를 들면. 예를 들면, 예를 들면, 예를 들면, 예를 들면, 예를 들면, 예를 들면, or 예를 들어서, 예를 들어서. This one also, for example, for instance, 예를 들어서, 예를 들면, 예를 들어서. Oh, so 예를 들면, 예를 들어서. For example, for instance, so we use this a lot, right? For example, 이렇게 예를 들면, oh, for example, 예를 들면, for example. <laughs> Yeah, okay? Okay. Okay. All right. So number three is actually she prepared this one. Uh, did you, okay. Something is too soon to know for sure. Something is too too soon to know for sure. This one. So we just made we just made uh kind of one situation, one dialogue. So hey, did you pass the interview? Or maybe it can be job interview or something. Anyway, we will do a lot of we will attend or we will join a lot of interview, right? So did you pass the job interview? And then what we can answer? It's too soon. Maybe it's it's too soon. 
it's too soon to know for sure. So, ah, uh, 잘 봐. First, we have to know interview, right? What is interview in Korean? Well, you know, Nini, interview. I can only think mochi. <laughs> Because okay. of the tanuru. <laughs> First, interview, we, we have two words. First, we can say, same. Interview. Mm. Interview. interview. But not interview. 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 Uh, or. Look at this. Oh, 면접. So, interview or 면접. This is more like Korean word, but we usually say interview mm -hmm. often but 면접 also we use often so we you have to know too interview 면접 okay so did you pass the interview so when we say pass here like a verb you know what verb we usually use like kind of get along with interview this one in korean 면접을 면접에 or 면접을 인터뷰를 verb는 처음에 통과하다 literally means pass. You know, like 통과하면, like actually this 통과 mm -hmm. literally means pass, really. Mm -hmm. 통과하다. So, yeah, literally pass 통과, interview, interview, interview 통과. Correct. But not only this, we have another one. 합격하다. Have you heard of? No, no. 합격하다. 합격하다. For example, when we take a test, like, uh, or when we take a test for to get kind of certificate, then, oh, did you pass it? 합격했어? Do, do you uh -huh. use, like, 잘 봤어? Oh, 잘 봤어도 돼. 근데 it means, uh, did you... Like, yeah, 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 to, to... Uh, I don't know very how to translate it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, 잘 봤어, 어, 진짜 잘 봤니? So, but how, for the uh, interview, does it also apply oh, to... Oh, yeah, we, you can say it, but it's like, 예를 들면, uh, your friend just took a interview mm -hmm. and then you can ask her like how was your interview? Chai basa is correct but it doesn't mean that no um, it's a little different. Chai basa means uh, did you take it well? Yeah, yeah, it yeah, it yeah, went yeah. well you know okay, uh, okay. so anyway so interview interview manja and pass tongwa hada and hapyok hada so how we can translate this one did you pass the interview manja hapyok okay how Myeonjo interview. 합격했어. This is the past tense. So mm -hmm. 합격했어 or interview 통과했어. Okay. Point in. Okay. Interview. Mm. So we can make two sentences. 면접 합격했어. Interview 통과했어. B. Oh uh, no no not yet. It's too soon to know for sure. It's too soon to something. Momo, ah, uh, No, what is no? Ara. Oh, alda, right? For sure. What is for sure? I'm not sure. Oh. <laughs> for sure, 확실히. Oh, okay. Or 확실하게. For sure. Are you sure? 확실해? 확실해. Oh. Mm. Are you sure? You know? Are you sure? How you how we can say this one? 확실해? 확... We can say this between friends. Mm. Like, 확실해? Are you sure? 확실해? Mm. Are you sure? Oh, no, it's a for sure. 확실하게. 확실하게. So, B. It's too soon to know for sure. 그러면, for sure 먼저 있습니다. So, 확실하게? 어. 확실하게. 뭐 하는 거? To know. 알기에. 봐봐. 알기에, to know, 알기에는 too soon, to, what is to in Korean? 도? 아니, 그거는 마지막에 붙을 때 to가 도지, 두, 여기서 to는 to something, like very something, very 아주? soon, to, 어, 맞아, 아주, 어, 맞아? 아주, or 아니면 너무, 아. 음. 너무가 뭐야, 여기서, to, 너무, 음. 확실하게, for sure, 알게, to know, too soon. 읽어봐. 
이루. 일러. 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 이르다. Actually, soon is 이르다. But this is like formal. Form. Can you say early? 일찍? 일찍. 근데 일찍이라고 쓰지 않아. 여기서 이르다라는 말을 써. Yeah, okay. it, this is verb. 일찍 is okay. uh, adjective. Uh, adjective 아니라 adverb. Uh, so here, 확실하게 알기에 너무 일러. 확실하게 알기에, 알, 알기에 올? 너무 일러. 아니 여기다 알기에는 해도 돼. 알기에는 너무 일러. 오케이. Okay. 어. 그러니까 이미 이미 어, 이미 I don't know yet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 아직 몰라. Mm. So you can say after this you can say 아직 몰라. What is 아직 yet? Mm. 몰라? I don't know. Don't know. Okay. So let's say this one. I will say English. Ah, uh, uh, I will I will speak Korean first, and you can follow me. Okay. 면접 합격했어? 면접 합격했어? 천천히 얘기해. 면접 <웃음> 합격했어? 면접 합격해서? 했어? 했어? This is question, so you have to ah, okay, like, okay. move up. 면접 합 합격해서? 했어? 했어? 어, oh, 했어. That that's correct. 했어? 면접 합격했어? 인터뷰 통과했어? 인터뷰 통과했어? 통과? 통과했어? 어. 확실하게 확실하게 알기에는 알기에는 너무 일러 너무 일러 아직 몰라 아직 몰라 어 잘했어 예 Alright, this is our second class of a uh, daily conversational Korean class and then yeah, and that's it for today and then we will see next Monday I mean we will see next Monday Alright, 안녕